Many cancer patients, especially those who've undergone breast cancer treatment, experience painful, swollen limbs, a condition called lymphedema. Now, researchers say they've found an underlying mechanism that could eventually lead to the first drug therapy for the debilitating condition. The findings come from research in mice and human cells. However, there's already a clinical trial underway to see whether these lab discoveries will translate into a new lymphedema treatment. People with lymphedema have excess fluid buildup in parts of the body, usually the arms or legs. Most often, the condition arises after certain cancer treatments damage the lymphatic system, preventing lymph fluids from draining properly. Right now, there is no cure or drug therapy for lymphedema. Instead, it's typically managed with measures such as massage, compression garments, and pneumatic compression devices. Lymphedema is not just a cosmetic issue. It can be uncomfortable, hinder range of motion, and make people vulnerable to infections, according to the American Cancer Society. Scientists turned to a drug called ketoprofen to develop a treatment.